Nine months ago, in April of 2012, we turned a new page in the history books of television in Sri Lanka. Along with that, we gave birth to a brand new concept, televised high school English debating. Our objective was very simple. It was clear. It was to provide the youth of this country with a platform. A stage where their views, their opinions will be heard of, irrespective of where they come from or who they are. Our journey started off with 25 schools. They came from near and far, from Jaffna, from Kandy, from Matara, from Colombo. And on this very stage, in front of thousands of viewers, they prove to you, they prove to us that the youth of this country, that our future leaders had a voice. And tonight, we will celebrate that journey. We celebrate the youth of our country and our future leaders tonight. We celebrate the freedom of speech. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the grand finale of the debater. When people meet, there will be voices. When people speak, they will be heard. Every human being has the right to freedom of speech. Universal Declaration of Human Rights. Over 20 schools representing every ethnic background in Sri Lanka took part in the debate. For the first time in the annals of the educational system in our country, national, international and private schools met on one stage. <laughs> It's unacceptable. See the debater, you can just say that it's just a whole new experience. You're going to have to speak up to people and you're going to have to face the right. Being a part of the debaters just makes us feel better. Buckle up, you're in for a tree. MTV debater. The debater has proven that the views of the youth must be heard, that the words they have to say are of value and that their thoughts have pertinence.
freely, they will bring the trophy to Madanga. Sadly, bring the trophy to Mother Anna. Thank you.